hey guys so this is the patio don't pay attention to the floors because we still got to clean this and all that this is the set right here it is a seven piece set i believe or the six i think it's seven though uh, this is how it looks right now we still got to get our curtains and all that so um but yeah this is how it's looking right now and i got it on some plastic so the cushions will not hit the plastic and then this is my uh swing chair right here which i'm not sure what i'll do with this i don't really want to get rid of it but um if i can put some decor on it that kind of matches the set it'll be fine but right now it's like black and gray and i feel like it went with like my last set so i'm not sure but yeah i just kind of got this in a corner right here um stuff like that so we're going to go ahead and put this together If you guys have a set like this and they have like these blue stickers on here, these actually come off. You just have to take them off with the screwdriver. And they'll just come off like that and that way the color matches. So right now I'm just taking all of these off. be brown like that.
girls. We just came from the grocery store. I want to cook tonight, to be honest. But I'm going to show y'all what I got from the store. Because I'm starving. Comment if y'all um, shop at Kroger's. I love Kroger's. Y'all, look at all this stuff I ended up buying from the grocery store. I'm telling y'all, this was not even my intent. Like, I literally, like, just went on, like, a mini grocery rant. Literally. So, basically, this is everything that we got. Um, so, I got some Ben's Original Ready Rice. Um, I got the garden vegetable and the butter and garlic kind. I got some classic... Kroger's bread and then I got me a pack of chicken I actually got two of these so I got this one and then I also got one over here and I got some Kobe Jack shredded cheese some butter ball turkey bacon 18 count of eggs I needed those and then I got two cans of green beans and two cans of corn also I got me some cinnamon raisin bagels I got me a bag of shrimp, a bag of salmon. I love shrimp and salmon, y'all. And then I got me some cream cheese. And then also I ended up getting some lunch meat. So I ended up getting the oven roasted chicken breast. And then my other one I got was the oven roasted turkey breast. I got some Kroger's orange juice, which I love. Then I got some noodles. So I got two packs of shrimp noodles, two packs of regular chicken noodles. Then I end up getting some gold flour for my chicken wings, some Kroger brand buttermilk ranch, and my ready whip for my coffee in the morning. Sour cream and onion chips for my sandwiches. And then this is just another pack of chicken right here. Which, y'all, chicken been so hard to find. Like, as soon as I seen it, I was like, oh, y'all need both packs of those. And then, we got some butter. And then this is a new Caribbean chicken seasoning that I wanted to try. It says, like, a taste of Jamaican. So, I really want to try this seasoning on my chicken. Comment below if you guys ever had this before. Then I got some of my Kroger's cookies. And also, I had got some Kroger water, and that's basically everything that I got. Tonight, I think I want to probably, I'm, I know for a fact I want to cook some chicken. So, I think I'm going to cook some chicken tonight, and then probably some rice and some green beans. Yeah. So, sometimes I'll, like, mix my green beans and my corn together, so I'm not sure yet, but yeah. I think that's what I want to cook tonight, so I'm going to put one pack in the freezer, and then... Leave one pack out. They pretty much come with a lot. Um, the stick ended up coming through this one, so it just opened up. But so I think I'll go ahead and use this one. So yeah. So yeah, it's the chicken wig wingettes. They said. So yeah. So yeah, I'll go ahead and cook these tonight. I think I'll put them in the air fryer, and I just love them in the air fryer because they be so good and it's quick and easy. So that's everything I got from the store. <laughs>
Hey guys, welcome to a new day guys. So we left off yesterday with kind of like building like the little patio set yesterday. Um, I am on a patio right now, like my little swing chair. And I'm really trying to debate if I want to keep the swing chair on here. You guys probably seen this last year. It's like black and it has like gray cushions. But I don't know if I want to keep this for the patio set because it's like different, two different colors. But we're going to go ahead and put on the um, cushions today. And I'm going to show you guys how those look. Now keep in mind that I still have to clean the floors out here. I just want to go ahead and put the cushions on right now. But more than likely I will go ahead and move the furniture around just to sweep the floor. And uh, get everything cleaned up. So just keep that in mind when you guys are looking at the patio. That we still have to kind of like clean and um, sweep off and water down the patio. So let's get started. Okay guys, so this beautiful furniture set did come from this company called Harness. Harness is a online home decor furniture company that sells all types of home decor, also furniture pieces for your home. And right now guys, they have a Harness Day sale going on where you can save up to 70% off. Also guys, you can shop by categories and also rooms as well. They have some very nice furniture pieces, very elegant. So anybody who has like that modern style or whether if it's like a rustic style or like a bohemian style, they have all the styles that you need and they can definitely have something that you can use for your home. I want to thank Harness for sponsoring this portion of today's video. So guys, as you can see, they have a whole like outdoor section. And right here on the screen, I'm showing you guys the set that I actually have. Like I said, it is the outdoor patio furniture set with seven pieces. Also guys, it is free shipping and simple returns too as well. So this is a very beautiful premium classic set. It is absolutely gorgeous. I love this. So if you guys would like to check this one out, I will have a link in the description for you guys to purchase. Good morning, y'all. Welcome back to a new vlog. So, y'all, okay, so basically, we already kind of started the patio as you guys seen earlier in the video. We um, put the patio set together and stuff like that. However, I did go ahead and take the patio set off the patio because basically, I want to clean it today. Remember, I was telling y'all I want to clean it, that's why it looks so dirty. Cause like over the winter it just got like real dirty. So 
today I am going to go to Lowe's. So we're gonna go to Lowe's today. And basically what I'm looking for is like this, um, like broom mop sort of thing. Um, and I wanna kind of clean the patio off. So I think what I wanna do is, I don't even think I even wanna deal with the water hose because I don't know how I'm gonna get on the patio without making a mess, but I know I wanna clean the patio, go to Lowe's, get this little brush, and just probably just honestly just clean it with some soap and water. I ain't gonna put too much thought into it because I've been in an overthought situation and <laughs> we done took it out, which is to figure out what kind of soap I wanna put on the ground. But y'all, um, that's what I have to do right now. Uh, the time right now is 9.02. Today is April 22nd. And I am dressed for today um, in my office right now. I'm, I'm loving this little background though, okay? Oh yeah, this is cute. I can deal with this. I like this little background. I was about to bevel my hair, but I was like, I ain't got to. <laughs> yeah, I be literally getting fully dressed just to go to the store. Because I like to look good. Because when you look good, you feel good. But, um... We're about to go ahead and head out. I'm already dressed. Lowe's opened up at 6 o'clock in the morning, so it's 9 o'clock. They've been open for hours now, so we're about to go to Lowe's, see what we can find, come back to the house, clean the patio. And then, I, I don't know what else I want to do today. Um, some home decor shopping would be nice. Um, I was thinking about putting this tree back outside in the corner. I don't know yet. I just feel like it's very tropical. Um, I think this was outside last year when I had the black and white, but I don't, I, I can't remember. But, um, I still need to get a rug, so I was thinking about going to Sam's Club to get a rug. Because Sam's got these, um, 8x10 rugs by, um, Safavia. Um, the same rug that I got in my living room, and they had them for like $100, and it was like 8x10. So I'm like, if I can get the biggest rug that I can, I can like make like a little like area for like, um, eating and stuff like that like a little eating table and stuff and then have like the um sofa and stuff on the other side and then y'all i'm still trying to debate if i want to keep the sofa by the mirrors or turn it but i'm gonna show y'all once everything go out so let's go ahead and get started <laughs> Okay, y'all, we about to go ahead and get out the car. We just pulled up to Lowe's, girl. It's a beautiful day outside today. The sun is shining, look at that sun. We about to go to Lowe's, y'all. I'm excited. Okay. So y'all, we are now in um, Lowe's right now. Y'all, why Lowe's got so much cute stuff? Look at this little set right here. Like, ain't this so cute? And this is the umbrella I was talking about. Like, would I be extra if I was to put this on the patio? This is so cute, y'all. Like, ain't this so cute? How comfortable is it, though? Okay, it's kind of comfortable. Oh, y'all, this is cute. A little comfortable seating. My, mine all big and bulky and brown. This is cute though. I like this. Comment below if you guys have one of these. Okay, so basically we are looking for um, the little broom. They do got like pillows and stuff here, but I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get my pillows probably on like Amazon or just, y'all know other stores got pillows. But um, y'all ain't been in Lowe's in so long, y'all. Remember when we had first renovated the house? Yeah, we we stayed in Lowe's. <laughs> we was in Lowe's like almost every day. But we looking for like this little like um, broom thing. Y'all, the lighting in here is sickening. We looking for like this little broom thing so I can clean the patio. So I'm about to ask somebody where it's at real quick. Let's see what we got, girl. So what I seen online, it was like, let me see. It wasn't this, but I definitely want to, let me see. Let 
it was like where is it at I'm gonna have to look online but it's like the bottom was like a let me see It wasn't this one. It was like a different type of, um, but this would be good to use too. This one right here. And that's 21. But it was another one though that I seen. Let me see if they got the L. Yeah, it was another one that I seen. It was like, is it this? Yeah. Can y'all get some assistance at the paint dust? That's so irritating. <laughs> Jesus. Um, let me see something real quick, y'all. I feel like, but it's not that though. Is it? Is it this one? Multi surface. I guess I could. I feel like a. I guess I could get this one right here. This one is, it says Quickie Bulldozer Multi-Surface. I guess I could get this one though. I don't know where the, yeah, literally. <laughs> I don't know where the other one that I was looking for, but I think I'm gonna go ahead and get this one right here for the patio. It's long enough. And like I said, we pretty much using this to um, basically clean the patio. But hold on, should I get like some little cleaner stuff? For the patio, they got all kind of cleaner stuff. Let me see if they got. Comment below, like, what do you guys use to like clean like your patio, porch, etc.? What do you guys normally use? I got plenty of buckets at home, so I don't even need that. Um, this, you know what? This is it right here. Here it go. <laughs> this is what I was looking for right here. <laughs> they look a lot smaller though. See, it got like these bristles on it. It's like rubber. This is what I was looking for, but honestly, it's too small. I might as well just go with the um the brush, cause like it'll like clean it better. But I'm like, should I? Now I feel like I need something to like mop it. Just kind of like mop it dry. Let me see. Um, let me see if I could find something. Okay, y'all, so we are now in the car. And y'all, I need to go to Walmart real quick. I need some coffee. If you don't know, I am addicted to coffee. I know it's sad. But I want to get some Starbucks iced coffee, and of course, my local Kroger's ain't got it. No surprise there. <laughs> but yeah, I'm about to go to this Walmart while I'm just in this area, because why not? It's really beautiful outside, right? It's time for the air now. <laughs> but yeah, y'all. Um, we about to go to Walmart real quick, girls. I'ma try not to do no shopping while I'm there. Like, you know, like any like patio furniture shopping. Because I feel like I just want this to like be a series. And I want to like do everything like step by step. So I don't want to do everything in one video. This would be like a five hour video. Maybe even a ten. So, and I want everything to be like, you know, nicely put together. Mm, look at McDonald's, that is tempting. <laughs> I ain't gonna do it. Oh man, I ain't gonna do it. Jesus, I ain't gonna do it. Ah! Mm, a little fry and a shake calling my name though. I ain't gonna do it. But, um, but what I'm gonna do is go to this Walmart and see if they got my Starbucks coffee with my macchiato creamer period but yeah girls we're about to go to walmart real quick so yeah
Oh, hey girl, so we are back at the house and we are on the patio right now. Um, I wanna show you guys what I end up getting from the store. Um, and then we're gonna get started. I think I wanna definitely get a bucket of hot water, bring it out here, and then probably like start like sweet mopping it, sorta. Of. But this is what we got. So, I end up getting this Zeep driveway and concrete cleaner. Um, this was at Lowe's, this was like $13 supposed to remove grease dirt oil stains blah 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 but comment below if you guys ever use this before and let me know if it's actually good or not and then I had got the moxie this is like the little like dry this is like the little like dry mop which I want to use dry and then I also have the quickie brush that I was telling you guys about which I want to use this to like kind of sweep the dirt up and like still wet it and like push it and then that's gonna be drying it so this is everything that we got from the store. Girl, look at this patio. Girl. Disgusting. I don't even want to do this. I'm not pressure washing this. We're just cleaning it. We are not pressure washing this. <laughs> That's why I got some little cleaner because, yeah. I know it's a lot of like dirt and oil and stuff. And yeah. These are the curtains right here from last year. But we're getting new curtains, so yeah. Just wanna tackle this floor first things first. As you can see, it's just dirt everywhere. Just a mess. A whole entire mess. Yeah, the patio look crazy. Now we're gonna go ahead and get started. Um, I'm gonna see if you gotta mix this little cleaner with water or not, but like I said, I'm gonna get a bucket anyway and probably pour it like on the patio. And then like start to sweep the dirt and stuff with the water and then I'm gonna use the other one to like dry so let's get started this is all like the dusty water which I want to be swept up by this little HVAC right here come on back but this is how it's looking so far see the difference and we ain't like most of the spots you see is like still dirt but we're gonna suck this up right here while I move some more over to the side
Good morning, my loves. I uh, hope you guys are all doing well today. So it is officially the next day. I did finish the patio yesterday, cleaning it, so I do want to show you guys today. If you're new here, hi, my name is Imani. Do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And if you're returning, then hey, girls, welcome back to the channel. So, y'all, um, I am getting ready to make some coffee real quick. Y'all, why well, I got all the furniture in here for the patio? Like, I had to put it in here because I had to clean the patio, girl. Now I gotta just scoop through here, like. <laughs> but um, I'm about to make some coffee this morning. Um, I have been feeling out of breath lately for some reason. I want you guys to comment and let me know. Like, have you guys ever felt that before? It's not. It's not like I'm out of breath. It's just more so like. I would have to take like a deep breath like every like minute or so. I'm like, I don't think that's normal, but hopefully everything is okay with that. But that's the only thing that's really on my mind this morning is these deep breaths that I keep having to take throughout the day. Um, so I want you guys to comment and let me know like, what do you guys think that is? Or like, have you guys ever experienced that before? But I'm gonna go ahead and make some coffee real quick. And um, I wanna show you guys how the patio was looking. And I'm gonna make some coffee and then um, we're gonna go outside the patio. Dirt and oil and stuff and yeah. These are the curtains right here from last year. But we're getting new curtains so yeah. Just want to tackle this floor first things first as you can see it's just dirt everywhere just a mess a whole entire mess yeah the patio look crazy So guys, this is how she's looking right now. She looks so good. Um, like I said, I did paint this uh, little trim right here white last year and the colors on the floor gray. I think this is the exact gray that's actually on my walls, I believe. I think, don't quote me, but I think this is the exact gray on my walls. Um, and I just thought it would look really pretty together. So I went ahead and just did um, my floors and the white trim and then the gray floor so I like that a lot so what I did was if you guys don't know last year when I did my patio makeover I did go ahead and put some mirrors up I was trying to go for like a different kind of vibe y'all know I'm just a glam girl <laughs> but I don't know if I'll be keeping those right here comment below let me know what you guys think but I did go ahead and bring my little tree out here which this was the tree that was actually in my room which originally I had it out here. It could pretty much go anywhere in my house, but I absolutely love this tree. It is like a fox tree. And I also put, as you guys can see, some of the moss in this one as well. So I had enough moss to go in basically all the plants. So this plant actually came from Target. And originally this pot was, I think, gray. Yeah, I think this uh, pot was originally gray and I ended up um, painting it black last year. So that's what i did on that i think when i first got this tree it was like 119 y'all this is the most expensive tree expensive fake tree <laughs> that i've ever gotten but i just thought it was absolutely gorgeous so that's why i ended up getting it really pretty it came from target um i think like two years ago because i actually had this tree inside my apartment when i had my black and white decor so yeah thought that was really cute these mirrors did come from big lots um Big Lots actually sell these mirrors. They actually keep them in the store, so it's not like something that's like temporarily. I know you guys probably never seen nobody uh, bring some mirrors outside on the patio like this, but it's the vibes for me. I just love a different kind of vibe. This is what I'm debating, but now that I'm looking at this side over here, I think I pretty much got my mind made up. So remember when I was saying that I wanted to have the couch like right here? I thought it would be like a really cute vibe. So like when I when I come outside and I come like on this end, you can just see the patio right yeah i feel so good out here you could just see the patio when i first come out like far as the furniture but now that i'm looking at it like now it does fit right here but it's a very tight fit 
Um, I'm pretty sure I think I want to bring it along this wall right here. I'm pretty sure I want to bring the set along here now. And then maybe put something over in this corner. So this is what I was thinking. I think it'd be cute if I had the tree probably in a corner with the set going like this. Because you know it's like a sectional. So like with the set going like this along the wall. I think it'd be better for one because it has more room and then it won't just be so cluttered up here in this area. So I think it actually looks really cute. Now as far as the rug, I want you guys to comment and let me know what kind of rug should I get. As you guys know, the patio furniture is brown and it has like a very light yellowish kind of cream tannish like cushions. So I do want to brighten up the patio furniture as much as possible. You guys know that I'm just really just on this journey of brightening up my space. So like I said, but I did want to try something different. Plus I have always wanted the sectional. So I'm glad I got the sectional. It's bigger. It's like more cozier too as well. And then also guys, we actually have some lights, but I'm not sure if I'll get some new ones, but I think I'll get some hooks. These are the hooks that I had last year right here. I think I'll get some different hooks to actually uh, put my lights up there. Um, I'll show you guys the lights that I have probably in like the next video. I think it looked really cute with the window right here And I just think this is a vibe too as well So I do think the sectional probably should go right here I want you guys to comment up under this window maybe the plant right there and I'm like should I bring back out my little swing chair? Because even though the swing chair is black and gray see I see that's the thing y'all Y'all know I like things to be cohesive and because it's like a brown like kind of like sofa I just feel like the swing chair is just not going to match with it. It's why I took the swing chair out. Now, I won't get rid of it. If anything, I'll sell it. But I really don't want to because I really adore my swing chair. And I've always wanted one. And when a company sent me one, I was like, that was perfect. But, yeah, um, let me know what you guys think I should do with the swing chair. And then if you guys like the sofa up under here. And if I should keep these two up right here. Which I think look cute for real. But, yeah love the floors curtains are going to be replaced as well do still have the string up here from last year not sure how i feel about that not sure if that's going to really matter i want you guys to comment and let me know do you guys like my paint color on my floors i absolutely love these i just adore these i think this paint color is so neutral i think it goes with everything and it definitely brightens up a space so just having this um paint color this color and then having like the brown furniture automatically it's going to lighten up the space because of the color of the floors so love that and yeah guys that's pretty much how it's looking it was so dirty i'll definitely show you guys the before and then you guys can see the after okay my love bugs so that is actually going to close out today's video uh, i hope you guys enjoyed the whole process of cleaning the patio i want you guys to comment let me know what do you guys think about the furniture that i have do you guys like it do you guys have the same sectional at home and then also have you guys ever used the cleaning product that i had used to actually clean your patio um i would definitely uh say 10 out of 10 would highly recommend it definitely works as you guys can see it cleaned the floors very well they're extremely clean now you can actually see the color of my paint now so i'm super excited for that and i want you guys to also comment and let me know what color rug should i get forest area rug and stuff like that so i'm excited so yeah because whatever area rug i get is definitely gonna be um it's definitely gonna be the pillows that i'll probably bring out so whatever area rug i get i'll just bring it out with the pillows that i decide to get so i'm so excited y'all for the patio because i just feel like the patio is like a very just zen place for me and it's just a place that i can come and relax and just kind of unwind and just chill so yeah i'm excited i want you guys to comment everything in the video i love you guys and i will see you guys in my next one bye guys you